What is up everybody, it's the Anime Watcher here and for today we're going to be continuing where we left off in Blue Archive's 4th volume, Rabbit of Kerbanog. So I have pretty much nothing else to say other than let's just jump right into the video, shall we? Heavy Rain Advisory, alright. So we just escaped that, right? We were captured, weren't we? A few days later marked the start of Kivotus' rainy season. Che Arana! Jeez, it's turning into a rainstorm out there. I hope Kivotos doesn't turn into a lake. Oh, Wait, why did they say all to that? Well, you might be dealing with the aftermath of this for a while. But I'm sure each school is taking the appropriate measures to keep their... Yo, what about Miyako and the others? What are they doing? I am a little worried about the SRT Academy students at Kusagi Park. There's not much shelter at the park, not even a building for them to hide in. I hope they don't catch a cold. Hell yeah, we're chads, alright. That sounds like walking, not like running, so, yep, just wanted to point that out. The tarp has holes all over it. Miu, we need more tarps. Th that was the last of it. We're all out. Damn it, we weren't prepared for this at all. Moe, are you still protecting your metal junk? You crazy? Put them down and come help us. Over my dead body. If any of my communications equipment gets damaged, I'll really show you crazy. These cost more than your life is worth. What about our guns? Our ammunition? I think your stupid equipment is the least of our concerns. If this rain doesn't let up, we'll lose everything. Are you done with the waterproofing? The spillway outside the park needs to be expanded and soon. The storm sewers are clogged with mud and are about to overflow. We need to free them up before we all drown. I'd love to help, but we're short-handed here. If we let go, everything's going to blow away. That was not the kind of explosion I like. It was a ball of lightning that hit the park. The butcher's holding up the command tent. It's collapsing! <laughs> no! Oh man, they did everything. The command tent caved in. All of our ammunition. All of our ammunition is underwater. I don't think it's underwater though. The communications equipment is ruined. This is it. The end of the line. It's okay. Don't give up. We just need to expand the spillway and I'm sure we can recover and repair some of the equipment. Forget about the stupid equipment! It's over, Miyako. Us. The SRT Academy. Everything's over. T Saki. If I had known this was gonna be the end result, I never would have tried. What are you saying? We all took an oath from the beginning. We swore to each other we wouldn't give up, that as long as we kept putting one foot in the front of uh, what? As long as we kept one foot in front of the other, we could carry the SRT Academy's mantle ourselves, didn't we? Pretty words and pretty oaths, Miyako, that's all that ever was. We can't kid up we can't keep up our little game of pretend forever. How did we end up here? When did our duties become the scavenge for food and still empty drum barrels so we can shower? We were better than this. We used to debate the intricacies of justice and bring down felons. Now... Now we're fighting over expired bentos with hobos. <laughs> That's still kind of funny for me, but I know it's such a serious situation. Tell me, Miyako, is that what you meant? Is this how you keep the name of SRT alive? This isn't the SRT I knew. 
All our worldly possessions are sitting a foot under... Again, it's not underwater. If the, if the tent caved in, it's still under the tent, right? I should just shut up. This is such a serious situation or a moment right now. I should just shut up. <laughs> Living out in the streets was fun at first, but it's getting tiring. Miyako, I want to go home. We arrive! Oh. Where are you going, Miyako? After all this, you look this disaster full in the face. You want to continue? Yes. I will keep the SRT Academy's justice alive. I'll never give up. Damn. They're at their low points right now. current is so strong. I don't know how long I've been working. I can't feel my hands and feet. Maybe they were right. Maybe I am a fool. But the justice I believed in, the school that I loved, no, you won't break me. Sensei? You're here to persuade us again? We don't have time for your silly jokes. Not today. I don't care what you have to say. I have to clear the spillway or we really will be flooded. Grab a show. Oh, hell yeah. That's so cute. I, I don't understand. Miyako, for you, I would do anything. So you just need the dirt cleared out from here? Yes, that's right. You're holding the shovel all wrong. Give it. Yay! They're all working together again. Dummies until the end. I want to help. Oh, so cute. The rabbit members and I worked tirelessly on repairing the spillway for hours. The rain finally stopped. <laughs> you all really pulled through. Great job. Get! Sensei, why do you continue to help us? We've told you again and again that we won't be persuaded. I've been trying to solve it this entire time, but I don't understand. What do you hope to get out of this? I'm not expecting anything. I'm just your teacher. Is that so? Most of our equipment is waterlogged and damaged beyond repair. But we did manage to stop the park from flooding completely. Thank you, Sensei. Goddamn my voice cracked. I, I suppose we wouldn't have made it without Miyako, though. But Sensei, wasn't your ultimate goal to get us out of this park? What kind of stupid Sensei would work so hard to help us stay here? We knew Sensei was a dummy since the first moment we laid eyes on them. <laughs> you you shouldn't talk to your Sensei like that, Moe. Aw, um, you're so cute. God damn it, she's so precious. We've rejected your help so many times and you still came running today when you thought we might need you. Thank you, Sensei. No problem, Miyako. i do anything for you like I said earlier. Later, I took my soaking wet self back to Shale. Perhaps it was the manual labor in the rain, but I, end I ended up having chills and aches for a few days after. Oh, damn. Rain-soaked bills. Okay. Are <laughs> are they gonna visit us? That's so gonna be cute. That's gonna be so cute and funny at the same time. If the SRT Academy students, they visit us like Miyako and the rest. Hello, Rin. Proposal? What is it for? 
just take a look at it. Hmm. A proposal to repair and maintain the facilities in Kosagi Park that were damaged by the flood? The task in and of itself isn't difficult. But how is this pertinent to chalet's activities? I mean, it's not exactly. Then tell me, is it pertinent to the SRT students? <laughs> Your silence speaks volumes. Four volumes, actually. I've read the report from the Chief of Defense. The SRT Academy students have taken up residence in the very same park they staged a protest in. And you've been looking after them. A conundrum. It isn't my place to criticize you, Sensei. The Shali organization is scrutinized in a way that I couldn't even if I wished. So instead, my opinion, the fact that those students are living at the park is immensely distasteful. I guess they've taken over a public park for citizens? Hardly. It's a remote park with a very few visitors. It would have been demolished at one point down the road regardless. However... The SRT Academy was at one point granted special immunity from the President of the General Student Council to maximize their effectiveness. But privileges should only be granted when it serves a purpose. With no purpose, privilege is this dangerous. You're already well aware of how the SRT Academy is perceived by most of the General Student Council. They fear them. And now you would like to house and arm these students who, in all technicality, are still in open rebellion? Imagine the chaos that would ensue if the administration board were to hear of this. Isn't there anything you can do, Rin? No, there is not. Okay. Okay. I met with every single chief of staff to enlist help. But every single response was a resounding no. Kaya! Welcome back! I missed you, Kaya! And now you've ended up here. You certainly have been busy, Sensei. Would you like some tea? There's no need. I suppose the urgency you feel can't be pla placated? Placated with pleasantries. Then, right to the point. I'm, a, I'm afraid I can't help you either. No matter what its students say, the SRT Academy no longer exists. As much as I've tried to find a loophole, it's impossible to use the General Student Council's budget for students of a non-existent academy. I tried to finance the park's renovation as an excuse, but that didn't work out either since the area's plans for redevelopment have already been approved. I'm afraid the extent of my power is maintaining the students' academic academic record so their data isn't expunged. I'm sorry, I wish I had a better answer for you. Yeah, you've done so much already, Kaya. Sensei, thank you for that, by the way. Have you enjoyed your time with the students of the Rabbit Squad? I'm fond of them. I'm happy to hear that. Please continue to look after those students, just as you have been. Oh, hello, Kana. Ugh. Back then at the Valkyrie Police School. What, what a coincidence. Hey there, Sensei. Do you have business with the Chief of Staff? Yes, you as well. Oh. Well... More or less, personal business. I expect I'll see you again, Sensei. Huh. Welcome, Public Peace Bureau Director. I'm glad you could make it. You look like your head is on a chopping block. You're not in trouble, Kana. I just wanted to report on my last request. Tell me, Kana, how much progress have we made on the reconstruction of Kosagi Town? Well, preparation- Wait, why is this theme- Why is this theme playing? 
Is it this theme when, uh, uh, oh my god. What were they called? Isn't this Black Suits theme? Oh my god. Is Kaya actually a bad guy? Or a bad girl? Well, either way, I do love my bad girls very much. Kaya, you naughty girl. We haven't been able to get them to vacate and it's causing delays in demolition. Come again. Oh my god, she literally opened her eyes. Public Peace Bureau Director, perhaps you misspoke. The Valiant Valkyrie Police School, protectors of Kivotos and keepers of peace. I would like you to think very carefully before you answer my next question. Are you to tell me that the elite of the elite of that school, the Public Peace Bureau, cannot muster the competence to rid of us of a handful of hippies? Oh my god, she really is bad! Ma'am, they're not your average run-of-the-mill homeless population. We don't know how or where they procured them. But they're armed to the teeth with the state-of-the-art weaponry. Oh wait, are they talking about the... the what were they called? The non-possessiveness group? I forgot there was a shorter term for it. But I forgot about it. They outmatch our riot gear and we haven't been able to gain a strategic advantage. Plus, those SRT students you helped out have settled down in the nearby park, making it even more difficult to move. I believe I told you to think carefully about your answer. Are you blaming me? N no, I beg your pardon, Chief of Staff. Oh my god, she's actually kind of hot like this, Jesus. You see, Kana, I like people who take responsibility. God damn, I like Kana like this so much. Am I the crazy one here? God damn. I think I might be the crazy one here. Me in my position as chief of defense. You as a director. We need to take responsibility for the duties of our role. What I'm hearing from you right now, director, is presumptuous nonsense. It's a disregard for your responsibilities. I hate that. And when people do things I hate, they end up in the same place as those. Oh my god. Two-faced. But I love her either way. <laughs> oh, Kana. Just a little joke. But since you're struggling with my request, some advice. Are you familiar with the lesson of three arrows? A single arrow will snap like brittle bones, but a bundle of arrows will not crumble so easily. And so... What do you do if you encounter a problem that brittle public peace bureau cannot solve? Simply gather more to your cause. You don't mean... I'm going to find someone less witless than you if you can't figure out what I mean. Y yes ma'am. Fantastic! I'm looking forward to reading your report. Do I like Kaya this way? I must be crazy. Well either way... I like crazy. Ugh, why is every single person I must work with entirely incompetent? I must have done something in a past life to deserve this punishment. Who the hell is this one? You don't mean us, I hope. Oh, don't be silly. You're the best partner I've had in my life. Wait, who's this? This is a, <laughs> this is a student. I will say, I didn't expect the rabbit squad and sensei to become such fast friends. Oh my god, she literally is a bad guy. God damn it. Fool me once, shame on me. Fool me twice, shame on you. Actually, no, it's still shame on me. No way, I said it the wrong way. God damn it. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. God damn it. Quite the opposite effect of what I intended. As an expert, what's your take in the situation? It's unexpected, but not surprising. <laughs> a boring answer as usual. We'll keep a close eye on them. Okay, so we have a mystery student now. Okay, okay. The fox and the Inari Jushi? Zushi. Got him. Okay, okay. Interesting. So Kaya is a bad guy. 
Okay. That's very interesting. Okay. Before heading to the rabbit squad, I visited a nearby town to grab a meal. Town near Kosagi Park. But for some reason, not a single eatery in town was open. Come get it while it's fresh. Hot in Narizushi. Oh, yo, she looks so cute. Good afternoon, sir. If you're looking for a meal, can I interest you in some delicious Inari Zushi? If you're on the go, this is the meal for you. The deep fried tofu pockets are rice filled, so you're filled. And luckily for you, I just made a new batch. You'll never find fresher. Yo, she looks cute. What's her name? This cannot be an NPC. She's actually cute. Thank you for your business. The streets are pretty empty today, so I was scared I wouldn't sell anything. It'd be a real shame to waste all this food. Come to think of it, all of the stores around here are closed too. Well, it's natural with all of the redevelopment efforts starting soon. Oh, you haven't heard? I thought everyone knew. Rumor has it they're going to build a new subway station here. And they're going to build a new shopping center on top of it. Seems like they're going to have to demolish the old plazas first though. Oh, so that's what Kaya was planning. Okay. It's this big old construction company behind it. What was her name again? Mm. They've got the big octopus logo. The cut. No way these guys are back. Yes, that's it. Kaiser Construction. Apparently, Kaiser Construction is staking the future of their company in the redevelopment of this area. But in the process, some residents were rudely ousted for um, their shops. Well, at the end of the day, I'm just a part-timer, so I'll always be able to find a new job. Yo, she really cute. Who is this girl? Seriously, who is she? Wow, you must really like my Inari Zushi. Thank you, I'm pretty proud of my recipe. My friends and underclassmen used to always say I had the best Inari Zushi they'd ever tasted. My friends from school say that, that is. <clears throat> Since you bought so much of my Inari Zushi, I'll give you some of the in hall. I'll, I'll give you some of the hot gossip. Okay, okay, I'm listening. Kaiser Construction hasn't even begun their redevelopment here. Because according to another rumor, the entire project might end up just being cancelled. What's that? Well, the homeless population around here. I'm sure you've heard that at least. Some group of hippies got a hold of a bunch of heavy-duty firearms and they raised all manner of hell whenever Kaiser construction workers even got close. To make matters even worse, a group of heavily armed students are occupying the park now. It seems like even the police have given up on security around here. With all these unexpected problems, I guess Kaiser construction is considering just getting out of the whole mess. Students in the park. Oh, do you know them? Wait! Is Kaya working with the Kaiser Corporation? Y you know, I kind of consider gossip my specialty. Here, take another Inari Zushi in the house. Do you know the students at the park? Do tell. I see. Why is she so cute? God damn, who is she? Well, I know a thing or two at least. Apparently, they're students from an elite academy. That's where they got all their high-tech equipment and how they took over the park. But the thing the rumors haven't addressed is they're doing living on the streets instead of the academy. You think they got kicked out? Or maybe it's just a silly prank. Or maybe they're just dreamers. Idle dreamers reaching for their impossible futures. What a wondrous privilege of the sheltered to dream. Is it hard, Sensei? Oh my god, she knows! Leading a group of students who won't come down from the clouds. So she knows? Hmm? How so? My job is to nurture their dreams until they can't help but become reality. You 
can find me. I don't hate the way you see it. Do what you think is best. <laughs> well, I think I'll close up shop. I probably won't be getting any more customers today. What's this? It's left over in our sushi. I wouldn't be able to finish all of it, so here you go. Refrigerate them for later. Or I'm sure there are hungry students around that would appreciate them. Oh, that's nice. Thanks for the chat, Sensei. Maybe we'll meet again. Oh my god, she's she's in that group, isn't she? The group with Kaya. Oh my god, we're actually gonna fight her. I don't wanna fight her though. Halt! Stay back, roll, oh, shoot! Hey, open your eyes, cry baby. This is what happens when you're too much of a scaredy cat to even look at the intruder. It's just sensei. Oh. I'm sorry. Hmm? It's just Ray sensei. Here I thought another dog had wandered in. It's like they think you don't have feelings. Anyways, why are you here? No one asked you to. <laughs> God damn it. Wait, what is that smell? Oh, m wait. Inari sushi? Miu Miu, a napkin. I'm drooling. Oh my god, they're the underclassmen. Bah. They're the underclassmen she spoke of earlier. Because didn't, didn't she said my classmate and underclassmen loved her Inari sushi, right? Oh my god! I I don't think you would, but you didn't buy these, d did you? Yes, I spent a lot of money on it. I found them in a hell no, I'm gonna say that. Suspicious. Yo, Moe kinda cute. She always was, but goddamn, her blushing in this scene. Saki, inspect it first. You don't know what it could be laced with. For the last time, it's just food. Hi, Sensei. Is that Inari Zushi? <laughs> Nostalgic. See? The upperclassmen at SRT used to make and eat Inari Zushi quite a bit. So it is her! Oh my god! She was their upperclassman! I hope I do hope they're doing well. Thank you, Sensei. Let's eat. Hey yo, Miyako trusts us now. I explained the entire situation with the rabbit squad while eating the warm snack. Oh, are we gonna get the name drop now? So the general student council refuses to provide any aid and a construction company intends to redevelop this entire area. While I naturally didn't expect much support from the general student council, the situation is more dire than I thought. And in this situation, all our gear and equipment is damaged from the flood. Well, we always knew we were fighting against the odds when we took on this commission. If we run out of bullets and we still have our hands, they won't stop us. I, I knew you were going to say something like that. But we have no more supplies and no one's going to help us. They're probably just waiting for us to be weak to fight back. And then we're going to be sold to the black market. The torture? No! Deep breaths, Miu. Sensei's looking after us, and I won't let that happen. Yo! Okay. So she accepts me looking after them now. That's nice. But in reality, we barely have enough firepower to fight off a squirrel, let alone a public safety bureau. If only we could repair the machine guns and turrets around the park's outskirts. Hehehe. <laughs> have you silly gooses forgotten about me? Of course. Your resident supplies expert at your most honorable service. Huh. The barter system. Damn. And that will be it for today's video, everyone. I hope you enjoyed it. So please leave a like and subscribe if you did. Or hit the bell notification below so you'd be notified of when I would upload my next video. I tried to... That's true, you are absolutely adorable, Fubuki. I tried up. 
Oh, that smile so precious. <laughs> okay, I try to upload as much as I can, so I would really appreciate the support. That's it for today. Thanks for watching, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. See ya!